we're live again um so i really have no clue where these videos are going oops <laughs> as far as the order they're going in but um i've never seen anybody put a boost gauge like an aftermarket boost gauge on a machine before so i'm pushing 19 pounds of boost um you know it's it's got the boost gauge and it just pegged out but i don't know i already bought it 17 bucks i bought that basically just to verify uh that the tune was pushing out and the turbo was pushing out 1900 so um i'm gonna mount it there I, honestly i'm just gonna zip tie that there i think it'll look fine it's not gonna interfere with the steering wheel um i'm just gonna uh route the the lighting wire and the vacuum through there and down and then I'm gonna run it behind uh, the, the in between the plastic and the frame all the way down I got just got 16 foot of it and then like I said I'll hook it up in there and then I got a boost gauge and we be golden and then I know I got all the ponies all right i'll show you where i that's how i had to get it through the frame i just took a rod something something stiff uh duct taped it and then i get underneath here so this is the driver's side i just went in between the frame and let me get it here so right here i'm just gonna zip tie it Hopefully, uh, I think it would be fine for the most part. It's pretty low in here. Oh. Um, but I just ran it along this frame here. And it comes out right here. And then uh, I'll run it somewhere. I'm sure I'll show you that up into there but i gotta figure it out but underneath that's what i did i'll zip tie it and uh bring it up in the steering column all right got the uh got it all wired up and and zip tied up so pro tip of the day make sure you know which block you're tying into um i have all my you know these are colorful wires going to this I was thinking it was accessories. This is power. My thought was accessory and then ground because I had, there was two grounds here. You can see that little red wire. It's actually accessories, ground, power. Um, Cause I was um, trying to, and I I didn't look underneath, but that's, it's, it's labeled. So pro tip of the day, just check your labels. Um, but got the gauge in and for right now i just got a zip tied it is what it is you can see my vacuum line my accessory wire there i have everything zip tied up in there i got the the line as you can see you can't see it because i was thinking you know i don't want rick uh rocks or nothing hitting it so i got it zip tied bunch of zip ties um throughout the frame that way it doesn't rub on nothing try to hold it but um it's behind the frame rail up and then in the dash over there and then i got the uh the back here the line right here try to run it as clean as i could <clears throat> over here down into uh the frame so fire it up and i'll show you what it's about so harbor freight right so you can just change the color whatever color you want i guess i kind of like the way the green is i mean there's only one little led it's 17 dollars So there you have it um it works and 
it's it's just gonna be a little cool feature um looks kind of looks kind of neat i got a, a razor back temp gauge coming that i'm gonna mount somewhere but uh um yeah i got that just to mainly test to make sure my tune was producing what it was supposed to be producing which it is so now i got it might as well mount it make a video on it um other than that it was it was pretty simple you got the you got three wires you got ground accessories and then power i just hooked the, the power and the accessories together so as soon as i turn my key on the lights on um if you don't want it like that you can just hook it up to where when you turn the headlights on that the light comes on but it's mechanical so if you have a turbo this works with any turbo um it's universal I, I i tested it before even hooking up the wire so if you don't want a backlight don't worry about the electrical part just hook up the vacuum line and you're good to go so hey thanks for watching if you like what you see if you're watching this for side by sides there's more to come and uh appreciate you